In America, we believe and teach in God we trust. Yet we know in those words that God depends on us, all of us, to do his work. Beth Barlow, the first daughter, right? Or something like that. Are you trying to give your father a heart attack? Maybe. Beth, your father loves you. He so desperately wants to protect you. There's nothing wrong with that. Things are changing in our country, but it's dangerous out there. What happened to Tabitha happened a long time ago. What's your sister got to do with this? Tabitha has everything to do with this. Are my ministries? Randall Mason International Ministries. Over 300 churches close every month in America. What are y'all gonna do, buy them all up? What's going on, Randy? Tearing the walls down. One message, one church, unifying religion in America. What about the message? Again, the message you don't come to church to even hear. One religion? I mean, have you lost your mind? I'm preaching to millions of people. No, the president's using you. More shameful, you're letting him. That's the problem in today's culture. We answer hard questions with simplistic answers. That's why this book is so important. And I think our friend Jake is exhausted by shallow answers. I'm going back. Why? Why? Because I don't want to be associated with this. And my father's name, his ministry? I mean, we grew up to, to change the world for Christ. Then change the world. I have never known a man other than my father with your passion. We don't need church buildings. And we don't need government handouts. Oh, you don't, do you? You're using words like unity and diversity to complicate an uncomplicated message. And he doesn't need this church to spread it. Take your hurt, your bitterness, your anger, and turn it into a force for doing something good. Not only did those words console a grieving father's heart, but they also ignited within my being a fire to change our nation. There is only one church, my church!